Hello, honey bunnies. Welcome back into me, Jenny. How is everyone doing today? Okay, my lovely, beautiful friends. We are going to dress up these little bunnies that I have here from the Dollar Tree. I added some like tiny little cupcake liners around the little collar of the bunny with this really tiny, pretty um, flower. I think it's like a, I don't know, like a ceramic-y kind of looking flower. And I added some googly eyes. I'm gonna come up close so you can see it. And I thought these were really cute. And so they're like little banners for Easter. And I love how they look. So I wanna show you a really quick way to dress these adorable little bunnies. I have another banner that I have to do here. I bought two banners. I bought this one and I bought this one. This one has carrots as well as bunnies. See there? Okay, so we're going to dress these up. I'm gonna put this one on the side. I'm gonna bring this one to work. And we're going to do these right here. All right. Now, you can always use a sticker, right? If you want, like an Easter-inspired sticker to add to the little collar, if you want. Um, what I'm doing is I'm using my cupcake liners. I'm using this little mini cupcake liner that I have. And what I did was I made like a little embellishment. I scrunched it in the center and I added the little flower that I showed you, all right? Let me come a little bit close so you can see because these are really tiny. So I have here my little embellishments made already, but I'm gonna show you how to make them. I have two here that I wanna show you. So this is a little flower that I'm actually um, using is they're called mini flowers they're kind of like little miniature flowers and I got these at Hobby Lobby um, you can really find these anywhere also you can find something similar to these would probably be these um like a, like little buttons that Michael sells or even Walmart sells them and I think the company's called dress it up and these are just little decorative buttons. You can find sh shapes of like flowers or any really shape that you like. But these I got at Hobby Lobby. And these are really pretty. And I thought they were really, you know, cute for the project. So what I did was I basically just took my cupcake liner. You guys know me with my cupcake liners. And these are just, just the little mini ones. I fold them in half like I always do. I squashed it in the middle. All right. And then what I did was I opened it up. And then I kind of just play around with it to get the size that I am happy with. All right. And this is basically mm, okay, okay size. All right. All right. And you just get something like this. And what we're gonna do is, we're going to add in the center of the cupcake liner, we're going to add the little flower, which are these right here, all right? I think I have another cupcake liner that I already made, this one, this is already made. Again, you can add you know, whatever it is that you want to add in the center of your little embellishment. I just love these little flowers. I thought they were really, really cute. And just gives it like a really simple but pretty look to the embellishment. You can also add pom-poms. You can also add buttons if you want. Um, you can even add like folk flowers if you want those like little fake flowers and you should get something that looks like this these are really fun little embellishments really simple but super cute and what i'm going to do is i'm basically going to add my embellishments to the collar 
of my um, bunny. I got two bunnies here and I got three carrots here. So let's see in the order that these come like this, like this, like this, and like this, okay? So I wanna add, on the carrots, I'm going to add the little embellishment right in this area right here. And on my bunny, I'm going to add it right in the collar area, as you can see there. I don't know if you guys can see there. All right, this is another one. I'm gonna add in the area right here. My bunny, I'm going to add it right here. And then my carrot, I'm going to add it right there. I'm gonna do the same thing with this one and the same thing with this one. You see that? How pretty that looks? All right, let's glue these down with a little bit of hot glue. We're just gonna glue these down. These really didn't take much time to complete, but I thought these were really pretty banners and I wanted to give it a like a really pretty finished look to them, right? And so I thought this kind of worked a little. It gives it like a vintage vintage look to it. Very pretty pastel simple but pretty color to the banner. Okay. Now that we have a little embellishment attached to the banner on the bunnies, I'm going to add some googly eyes. I have here some googly eyes that I want to add to them. I was going to add pink eyes because, you know, Valentine's Day, but it kind of looked funny. So I'm just going to stick with the regular googly eyes because I kind of don't want my bunnies to look like weird. They look a little bit weird with pink eyes. And to be honest with you, it looks a little bit creepy too. <laughs> so I'm going to add my googly eyes roughly around here. Okay. Roughly around there. And I'm going to do the same thing with this one. Now if you want to go right ahead and add more little um, things to your embellishment, you can. You can add, um, this one is a little bit too big. If I put the eyes, it's not gonna show. So let's kind of make it a little bit more smaller. Scrunch it a little bit so I can add the googly eyes and it can show. Okay. Um, if you wanna add more things to it, you can, obviously, right? To make it more decorative. Um, but I like to keep it kind of simple for the office. I don't want to go too crazy. All right. There you go. And there you have it. There you go. And that's, that's how I did this. This is how I kind of finished it off a little bit. I didn't really do much more to it. I wanted to put a little bow, maybe. I was gonna thinking of putting a little bow, but I kind of just like it this way. I like it simple like this, kind of just very minimum, but very pretty and very vintage-y looking. I really do love the carrot on it. I think the carrot looks really, really pretty. And I think it looks nice. Oh, we forgot this one. Look at that. There you go. That's it, guys. And that's what I did here. I mean, I really, I really didn't do much, as you can see here. But it does look super pretty. And it looks so delicate. And I just love the little touches that I add to the little bunny and the carrot. I think it just looks really, really pretty. You like it? I hope you guys like this. All right, my loves. I hope that you enjoy watching me make these 
pretty little banners. I'm going to make some more videos for you guys soon. And I will be back with another tutorial. Make sure you guys like. Make sure you guys subscribe. And um, thank you so much for always returning back to my channel, my loves. I love you all. Bye.